If you want to lift it, little trick Perler showed me. He used to lay on the guy's leg right here. He'd be right here laying on the guy's leg outside. So he's here, I got my gut, and I like to lift to my left side so I block a guy. As I go, I step over, I lay on that leg. Freestyle, you can lay on the leg, get your lace. And then he used to be a big swing step. He comes here and swings up here. Cool. Blow that guy out. Now, a guy's going to get real heavy right here. He's going to get some legs wide, arms wide. Get him up. And now, you take your time. You're either going to slow arch if you're an arch guy, or you go forward with it. It's a step forward and a pivot. I'm not going to get close on that. Who's arching who? If you're an arch guy, you get him up, up, shaking, wrapping, wrapping. You take him. Once his feet are off the ground, guess what? He can't hook my legs. For five. For five. For five. For five. So he picks, he lifts, up. Watch Jerry over there, guys. Down he goes. If you're an arch. We got the trash mat this afternoon. You can start working on your arches over there. Let me actually finish up with some of you guys here. And then there's the pivot forward, which you also see from a tripod. If a guy goes tripod on you, freestyle, you pivot forward. Greco, you pivot forward. You pivot forward. Me. Go. Preference. That's just one trick. You don't have to do mine. You guys like to just pick up. Up, up. Guys getting heavy. Guys going to step outside. He's going to step outside with that back foot. See, that's a, that's a low arch. Low arch, and the motion is spiral, twisting. Freestyle, do the freestyle tripod when you get a guy. Record you see it too. You might sweep in on the shot. Guy's doing tripod. You're back behind. You pop it right from here. And that pivot is key. The freestyle guy can grab your legs. But once you've got a big step forward, then, yeah, go, go. He swings out, step. Guy can't stop it because he's so torqued. There's so much torque on his upper body. He can't go anywhere. On freestyle, we always show it. Tripod. When you bring that leg up, you want to make his hands walk. I'm making his hands walk. I'm stepping on that outside leg. Breath go two. Here, step. And then I'm going to pivot. Go again. Things I've always felt if you're long and lanky, those have always been the best record guys. Short stocky guys are hard to get off balance and get out of position, but always the best archers and the best throwers have always been the long lanky guys because they get a lot of leverage and a lot of torque on your body. If you're short, for me, I stuck with guts. I was a dragger, but I was a big time fireman's guy here, in here, no leg, shoulder bump. On my feet, I scored there. On my on bottom, I scored my reverse left with my gut. They were never high arches. But these guys, if you get those long, the long and lanky, you get that slow arch position. Take your time when you get him up. Wrap him up. Questions? Go work on lifting out from a gut. So tie it in with your gut wrench. Hit your gut. I gut a guy through. And as soon as I come out of that, get a lift in there. Gut wrench at each other. Gut wrench, and then right to that lift. But that guy's going to lay there. Remember, a five period's over. Because you will open up once you got it. He forgets about a lift. He's going to gut wrench it. He gets to his gut, knees forward, knees forward, brings the guy through. Oh, nice, going right to his lift. Right to his lift. Tied it to the gut. Five. So put that in. Work on your gut, lift. Either spiral, and if you want to start working on a five, we'll put the blue mat down right now. All right, let's go. Finish up, finish up the last session.